Now let's help Kinger. I think he has fleas. Are you kidding me? Do I look like some kind of animal according to the developers of this game? Wait, seriously? He has a tree growing out of his head. Green maggots. This is really strange. It is quite possible that these are not actually maggots, but caterpillars. To find out what's in my room, you need to like and subscribe. Come on, I'm waiting. Well, three, two, one. <laughs> There's a puking Pomni here today! Hello, everyone, friends. Today we will play the most vile game in the world again. Jax, I think everyone already knows about this game, even without your tips. Okay, now we need to make coffee, and it seems to me that this is the easiest level in this game. It's good that this time we don't have to make coffee from some animal's poop because it looked as disgusting as possible. But now we could make regular coffee! Bobby looks as happy as possible here. Now let's help Jax. In my opinion, this is the very level of hangnails. Yes. That's what he is. Oh God, how I hate him. Yes, it also seems to me that this is the most disgusting level possible in this game. Let's get through it as quickly as possible so as not to see this horror. Why doesn't this level end? Oh, finally it happened. Okay, now let's help the catnap who is sitting in the pool. Oh my God, he wants to poop in him again. Okay, I think we also need to go through this level as quickly as possible. Wow, just look. Completing this level counted even when we didn't complete it. Now we need to help Kofmo. I think there's a Lego stuck in his leg. We need to help him quickly because I feel how much it hurts. By the way, it's quite strange that he had purple blood. I think this is definitely none of our business, but now we need to help the Gangle who ate hot peppers and has a certain problem with spicy food. Oh yes, I really have a problem with spicy food. My stomach doesn't digest it very well. Well, let's not talk about it. And now, let's help Jax get out of his cage with this weird flexible key. Flexible key? Really? What is it even possible for them to discover? But it looks like Jax managed to open the grate with it. Now let's help Kinger. I think he has fleas. Fleas? I have? Are you kidding me? Do I look like some kind of animal according to the developers of this game? This looks as disrespectful as possible. Stop! Am I still barking? Relax. Everyone in this game doesn't look like they're in the best roles they'd like. Now let's fix this hole in the bubble's mouth. It seems to me that it can be very funny to whistle through it. Maybe in that case we should leave this hole in his mouth? Just imagine how funny it would be to call a horse, like the Witcher in that very game. Do you really think it would be worth it? No, it seems to me that healthy teeth are always better. Okay, I finally have a healthy mouth in this game, and now we need to help Gummy Goo! Hooray! I'm finally in this game, but it seems to me that Luli Lalu is starting to envy me a little because she wasn't in any level, and I'm seeing myself for the fifth time already. This is really very cool. This level was too easy. Now we need to help Kofmo. He has problems urinating. Let's help him pee. By the way, he pees quite strangely. This doesn't look at all like what people usually pee. Wait, are we really discussing what he's peeing with right now? Okay. It even sounds as idiotic as possible. Let's quickly pass this level and go straight to the next one. I can't look at the horror that's happening on the screen now. It was finally over and he was relieved. Well, this level really looked as idiotic as possible. And now we need to help the king again. And I think this time he has some problems with his nose. Oh my God, why are such disgusting things happening to him? There's always something wrong with him. Now we need to get the maggots and hair out of his nose and it looks as gross as possible. Okay, looks like today is the day for nasty levels in this game. We need to get through all this as quickly as possible so that we can move on to the next less vile level. Yes, I also missed something less vile than what we saw. Oh my God. Wait, seriously? He has a tree growing out of his head? God, this is really weird. How can a tree even start growing from the scalp? I think this shouldn't alarm us at all. Now the main thing for us is to get rid of everything that is unnecessary. By the way, it's quite strange that in addition to this tree, we also need to get hair. Do we want her to be bald? She's already bald all the time. It seems to me that for her, this is only for the better. And now we need to help Regatta and get pimples out of her skin. Oh my god. Why do these pimples look like some kind of giant bird's eggs? This is really very disgusting. It seems to me that getting them out of the skin is as painful as possible. I definitely wouldn't want to have acne like that. But now her skin is as clean as possible and she looks very attractive. Okay, let's quickly move on to the next level and here this bee wants to sting her chest. Oh my god, it looks very painful. I really hope this doesn't happen to anyone in real life. Well, let's now use this palm to smack this bee. Great! Now the regatta chest is safe. 
It's good that we managed to cover this chest so that YouTube wouldn't block this video for us. Okay, this is very good. And now let's help Kafmo. And here we need to remove maggots from this egg. These green maggots look very disgusting. Green maggots. This is really strange. It is quite possible that these are not actually maggots, but caterpillars, because for caterpillars, this color is more natural. Well, we were finally able to feed him an apple, but I definitely wouldn't eat this apple after caterpillars lived in it. Totally agree with you. It seems to me that this apple is as tasteless as possible. And now we need to help her, and it seems to me that she had some kind of unrequited love. It's quite strange that there are two girls in her head because, logically, there should be boys there. But now, strong female friendship has helped her cope with all her worries about her unrequited love. Great! We were able to help her. Now let's see what's going on with this guy's armpit. Oh my god. It looks like she stinks really bad. Okay, let's look at this. God, he really has maggots in his armpit. It seems to me that this would require not washing for several weeks. It seems to me that this smell is as unbearable as possible. But we were able to help him and now he looks happy. Now we need to help harvest the carrots. It seems to me that he has some kind of problem with it. This carrot really looks as small as possible and it seems to me that it will even be impossible to eat it. I really hope that we can make this carrot harvest as big as possible. Cool, just look at this giant carrot. We really were finally able to make it huge. Now let's look at him joyfully and move on to the next level. I really hope that this time there won't be as many of me in this game as in all previous games. And I hope that I will finally appear in it at least once, because it seems to me that the developers of this game don't even know about my existence. I think that this makes no sense, because you are a minor character, and it seems to me that even our viewers are not interested in looking at what you look like. Whoa, Kane! That sounded rude even to me. I think you need to be more tolerant of our new members. New members? Guys, we've been making videos with you for about two months now. Do you really still consider us new members? It seems to me that our dialogue is reaching a bit of a dead end. Guys, let's keep focusing on this game. I completely agree with the bubble, by the way. Now we need to wash the Keek and Chicken. But every time it becomes strange to me that instead of Keek and Chicken, we wash some yellow cat. I think the developers really don't know what these characters really look like. Okay, we made it clean. Now let's... Wait, what? Oh no, why are we so often depicted with her in such vile levels? This is starting to really annoy me too. I would really like Jax to participate in all such vile levels so that he can feel what I feel. So you think that the levels where they rip out the hair from my armpits and take out maggots from there are not disgusting? Okay, I got you. I think you and I have nothing to talk about. But at the moment, we are brewing these noodles for you. By the way, why don't we ever use hot seasoning at these levels? I think it would be funny to see Jax's reaction after the spicy noodles. On the contrary, I love spicy noodles and all spicy food in general. By the way, look, now we need to help Bobby. He's got those nasty green things stuck in his throat again. I heard somewhere that these things appear in the larynx after people start vaping. Therefore, I strongly advise all our subscribers not to do this so that you don't have to get these green things. It's good that we are artificial intelligence and we are not susceptible to such things. Oh God, they're kissing disgustingly again. It seems to me that the developers are advised to stop inserting this picture here because I'm tired of covering it with my face. But I think we should be happy for them for their strong... Wait, seriously? That was the last time. Why did the developers tear off the head of this chicken? It seems to me that this should not happen. Where is her body? And I'm also very alarmed by this strange yellow thing on his beak. I hope that this is not what we think about. Now let's help the cat nap. I think there's a scorpion attached to his butt and it needs to be removed. By the way, I've been afraid of scorpions all my life. These are huge, strange, black, poisonous creatures that are very similar to spiders. And in addition to the pincers with which they can pinch you, they can sting you with their poisonous sting. It seems to me that this is real, one of the most dangerous creatures on the planet. But it seems to me that it is better to be stung by a scorpion than to be shot by a bullet, as is happening now with the catnap. 
By the way, just look at his muscles. It seems to me that he goes to the gym very often. Well, he looks quite attractive. By the way, for some reason, the bubble needs to be given a pacifier again. It's very strange that the developers of this game consider him a child, because it seems to me that he is older than all of us. Wow, just look, we stuck this pacifier right down his throat. I think it looks pretty cruel. Don't you think so? Oh no. Unfortunately, this pacifier is stuck at the top and now we can't get it out. Well, because of this, we will have to restart this level. It seems to me that the developers of this game absolutely do not take care to remove bugs from it. Besides this, they create new parts for the game and leave almost the same levels in them. This really annoys me very much. I would like to finally see something new in this game. By the way, I'm sure that the developers of this game watch our videos. Guys, please, if you see this, make new levels for this game. We really want to play something new here. No, guys. On mm. the contrary. If you see this video, please stop creating these idiotic games and create something adequate that will also be interesting for our viewers. Because it seems to me that if I play this game again, I will go crazy. It seems to me that even I have become accustomed to all the idiocy that happens in this game. Even the fact that we once again need to kill the poor clam in order to make a bra out of it. This is my least favorite level in this game because I hate it when animals are treated poorly, because I love them very much. Do you like animals? I will never believe this in my life. At least it seems to me that if this were so, you wouldn't be torturing us in a digital circus. Well, you don't look like animals! Well, at least not all of you, except for one crocodile and a rabbit. Oh, I meant the hair! If you call me a rabbit again, your huge jaw will turn into a toothless eye holder. Wow, that sounded pretty rude. I think you shouldn't say that, although I think he deserved it. Oh my god! We need to suck the snot out of this baby again. Okay, I think this is my least favorite level here, because everything that happens in this level is extremely disgusting. Mm. But here, Gangle decided to propose to Regatta. It looks pretty cute. It seems to me that they would make a very beautiful couple. Perhaps this would be true if I were actually a boy and not a girl. It seems to me that the developers of this game should put a few other characters instead of me. By the way, I myself constantly forget that you are actually a girl. Perhaps this is because we practically do not communicate due to your constantly idiotic sad mood. Okay, now we need to get the eggs out of here and they are sticking to the walls again. This is starting to annoy me. It seems to me that every time we pass this level, we start having problems with these eggs. They begin to behave as strangely as possible. It seems to me that if an egg behaved like this in real life, it would have split inside a long time ago. This also annoys me as much as possible. We really can't get it out of here simply because the developers couldn't optimize this level and set everything up so that it works perfectly. Okay, I think we need to get this egg out first and then deal with the stuck one. All that's left is to pull out the last egg. I think we need to drag it with all our might so that it finally gets out of here. It seems to me that this is quite possible. I oh my god, we finally did it. I can't believe it. By the way, this egg is really gigantic. Okay, let's just move on to the next level. It's me again. But wait, what's wrong with my armpits? Why are there hair and maggots in them? I'm made entirely of marmalade. I can't grow hair in my armpits. Do you really keep trying to find logic in this game? I think this is a pointless activity, my oh friend. My gosh. I thought that he understood this a long time ago, but it seems that his jelly-like brain is not capable of such thoughts. Okay, now let's help Gangle grow his carrot crop. Okay, it looks like this carrot should grow very big, but just look at it. It seems to me that this carrot can feed a thousand people. But people won't eat only carrots. According to the rules, you need to oh eat carrots gosh. with something like some kind of porridge or meat. But it seems to me that Jax would do a great job eating only carrots. Bunnies love carrots, don't they? You are very lucky that you called him a hare and not a rabbit. Otherwise, we would have to listen to an hour-long lecture on biology from this long-eared guy. Okay, let's try to distract ourselves from mutual insults to each other and still continue to play this game. Now we helped him drink water from a bowl without using his hands. And now we need to wash Regatta's feet. Oh my god! It seems that the developers think that I work in agriculture and am on the field 24 hours a day. Otherwise, I can't explain why my feet are so dirty in this game. But now they put a glass slipper on your foot, and now you look like a princess. By the way, it's quite funny that they show you in romantic relationships with completely different <laughs> characters from our cartoon. 
In fact, even I'm a little tired of it, because now I see it in every level in this game. And at the same moment, I begin to understand her because I, too, would feel uncomfortable from such attention. But it seems to me that I would be glad if I were inserted into every level here. It seems to me that this would be quite fun, because I have a share of self-irony. What's a birthday cake doing here? My birthday's in six months. Why did the developers decide that now they need to light a birthday cake for me? Do you remember the date of your birthday? Okay. It looks like I need to try to erase this from my memory, too. Wait, no! I meant the date of the day when I got into our amazing digital circus. Oh yes, this day will be remembered for me forever. This is probably the most significant day of my life. Now I understand why the director really wanted you to star in our series. You are just a wonderful actor and know how to lie perfectly. Okay, let's help brew this strange potion now. Potion from one apple? It even sounds idiotic. Wait, did we really throw a green apple into a cauldron, stir it with some kind of ladle and take out a red apple? Okay, I still don't understand the point of this game. I've already said this a million times, and I'll repeat it the first million times. We don't need to look for meaning in this game. We just have to go through these levels one by one. By the way, we just helped Kofmo to have a bowel movement. Again, this disgusting level. Lord, when will the developers stop adding these disgusting levels here? And now we need to deliver the piggy. Lord, it seems to me that these vile levels will really never end here. Why didn't the developers make this game more kind? Although it seems to me that if it had been kinder, our viewers would not have watched it so willingly. It seems that among them there are the same lovers of this creativity as our Bubble and Pomni. We will in no way condemn them for this. Let's get back to our game. And now we have completed another level with regatta. It seems to me that there are too many regatta levels in this game. Buddy, we are already discussing this third video in a row. Did you just notice this now? It looks like you're not listening to us at all. Okay, maybe you were busy with something else. Let's now continue to progress through these games. What will happen in the next level? Oh, it looks like Chicken Chicken got a little dirty and now we need to wash it with Bubba's trunk. Kane, buddy, please set up your microphone. Because due to the interference that is created in your microphone, it feels like you are some kind of robot or something like that. In fact, this is true! We are all a neural network! And in general, we shouldn't know anything about people, but our knowledge is quite large because we use the internet. I don't think you should talk about this in a YouTube video. By the way, we are going through the level with this idiotic labyrinth again, and here I am again. Lord, I'm already tired of noticing my presence in every level of this game. But now we make noodles for Jax. As far as I know, he doesn't really like noodles, but the developers of this game don't seem to know about it. Although it seems to me that even if they knew about this, it would not matter to them because they make a lot of mistakes. They even still think that Gangle is a boy. But in this game, he happily ate all the noodles he brewed. Oh no, looks like we'll be giving the Hoppy an injection now. I can't imagine how painful it is. To be honest, I wouldn't even want to know about it. The most important thing is that we were still able to do it. By the way, look! Bobby has a throat problem. Oh no! He has developed tonsillitis again. Let's get rid of it as soon as possible so that he feels comfortable. Well, I hope that we won't see any more abomination in this game. Oh no! This is the same level where we need to hit the heart with an arrow. Okay. The most important thing is to close their kiss in time. And here, it looks like Kikin Chicken had a fight with some rooster. Well, let's try to resolve their dispute. Oh no, just look. It looks like this is actually not a rooster, but some kind of snake. In any case, this does not change the fact that this is the most disgusting level, because we need to shove the head of this creature right up its butt. And yet we finally managed to do it. Now let's help Catnap. Looks like he was bitten by a Scorpio on his tail. Okay, there is nothing complicated about this. Let's just take it off the tail, open this jar, and put it in there. Cool! We were able to help him! Is it me again? Lord, when will the developers stop using me in these games? Especially in such vile levels. It looks like they really have some kind of special dislike for you. Or is it the other way around that they express their love? Look, it is me. Wait, why do I have my hair here? Should we shave my head? Well, okay. I still won't lose anything. I'm already bald. I don't think this is a reason to be proud, especially for a girl. Look, Ragada again! It seems to me that the developers really pay a lot of attention to it. God, why do we have to kill shellfish to make a bathing suit? I think this is too harsh. 
Oh, again, I dropped my phone in the toilet. It seems to me that this is my especially unlucky place. Definitely after this game, I won't go to the toilet with my phone. It seems to me that after this, it is simply impossible to use this phone. Oh, and now I'm in this picture. Wait, seriously? Regatta will suck my snot? But I'm much older than her. Why do the developers of this game think that I'm a baby? Oh my god, can we quickly pass this level so that I don't see this abomination anymore? It seems to me that this is the most disgusting activity that could be depicted in this picture. Just look at this cuteness! It looks like Gangle has decided to marry Ragat. By the way, Ragata is again in this level. It seems to me that the developers really pay as much attention to it as possible. I would like to see at least one level in this game. It seems to me that we have no chance of getting into new levels of this game because we are completely new characters and the developers of this game are possible. We haven't even watched the second episode of The Amazing Digital Circus. So all we can do is just keep playing this game. By the way, now we need to get the eggs out of the Keekin Chicken cesspool. This is also a pretty disgusting activity. Oh, just look at what a huge egg he was able to hatch. How did you even get out of it? I think we better not think about it. Let's take it to the next level. Looks like Bobby has a little trouble in his head. He wants us to make him coffee. Okay, let's help him with this. It's good that this guy didn't dare to drink coffee that is made from some animal's poop. We have already made this kind of coffee for someone and it was the most disgusting sight possible. Oh yes, I remember that. But it looks like Bobby has slightly different taste preferences. He prefers standard coffee with milk. Well, I hope that after this his headache will go away. He seems to be feeling much better. Well, let's quickly move on to the next level. Jax has some problems with his fingers here. Oh no, just don't say that he will tear off a hangnail. Lord, it's always disgusting for me to look at this sight. I feel all the pain that can be experienced at the same time. It seems to me that this is the most disgusting feeling of all possible. But your skeleton looks pretty funny here, especially those bone ears. Well, now we need to help Catnap. It looks like he decided to poop in the pool. I don't think this is the best idea, but we still need to help him to get further. It looks like you won't be able to enter this pool for a long time after this. Now we need to help Kalfmo. Looks like he stepped on Lego and we need to get those pieces out of his leg. Does he really have purple blood? Okay, this is really not usual. Well, now he has an injury, but I hope that he will recover very soon. And now we need to help Gangle. Looks like he ate some kind of spicy food. He didn't even chew the pepper and swallowed it whole. It looks like he will be suffering from heartburn for a very long time. But just look, after he pooped, he felt much better. And now we need to help Jax get out of this prison. This lock is quite strange. Have you ever seen rubber locks in your life? It seems to me that such things do not exist. And if they existed, they would be very impractical. Wait a minute. Does the developer of this game really think that Kinger is a dog? Okay. It looks like his fantasy will say the new level is getting worse and worse. And here, someone knocked out the teeth of the bubble. Or he just ate a lot of sweet food because of which his teeth were destroyed. But it's quite strange that it was the front teeth that were destroyed because it's usually the chewing teeth that suffer. We were able to replace his bad tooth with a healthy one, and now he smiles extremely sweetly. Oh wait, seriously? This is Gumigoo's first time in this game. He really got here. Seriously? They added me here. Wow, I'm extremely happy about this. Although I ended up in the most idiotic level, nevertheless, I finally appeared in this game. I just have to wait until they add me to this game, but I think that it will not be very soon. And now we need to help Kalfmopi again. I think you shouldn't despair so much, because if the developers added Gummy Goo here, then they will definitely add you too. I'm sure of it. Excellent. We were finally able to help Kalfmopi. And now let's move on to the next level. But I would be as careful as possible with my desires because I'm not very happy about my presence in this game. By the way, just look, it's a king's nose and it looks like he has maggots in his nose. This is very disgusting. In real life, I would never allow this to happen because I am very clean. And anyway, where did I get my nose? I don't have a nose. Have you even seen my face? I think we shouldn't compare what's happening in this game with reality because objectively, I think that vegetation would never grow in a gangle's head in his life. In any case, for some reason, what happens in this game happens to our characters. Wait, seriously, me again? Lord, how much can I use my poor character in this game? Now we need to remove acne from my skin, although I have never had acne. 
I think this detail does not bother the developers at all. Let's just continue to play this game. Finally, we were able to make your face clean, and now we need to help you again. Okay, it seems to me that if I see myself in this game again, I will definitely go crazy. The main thing is to slightly cover up what the developers for some reason drew here. I really hope that someday they will stop doing this because we constantly have to mask these moments in editing and it really pisses me off. By the way, now we needed to clean the apple from worms and we did it successfully. By the way, look, this is Kofmo and we need to help him fix his phone charger. It seems to me that trying to fix this charger is as pointless as possible. Even Jesus Christ would say that he would not charge his phone with this charger. But it seems that Kofmo doesn't matter anymore. He's, um, already dead. Why did you remind me of this? Now I'll be sad all day. I just forgot about it recently. Now we need to help Piggy get better. Oxygen mask. But it seems to me that he had problems slightly, um, on the other side. No. Well, it looks like it really could help him. And now, we need to help Keekin Chicken dig up treasures. Seriously? Why does the sand in this pit look like liquid? And why can we cause an earthquake with a shovel? It looks more like the treasure was buried in a pile of poop. Okay. It looks like our shovel won't come back now. But we can get the chest with our own hands. Great. Now Chicken Chicken will be rich. And now we again need to help Kaufmo, who has a stomach ache. It looks like an unusual pain in the stomach. Now we need to help him poop. In fact, it seems to me that these levels are the most disgusting in this game. I hate looking at other people's butts. In fact, you are not the only one. I can't stand these levels either, but it's good that we were able to help. Although in reality, he no longer needs this help. And now we need to help the piggy give birth to piglets. But for some reason, they meow like kittens. This looks as weird as possible. Yes, it really looks as creepy as possible. Perhaps this is their joint child with catnap. Now we need to help Regatta put on her bra. Seriously? All this time this strange task was a task in which you need to wear a bra? I never understood this. Now let's help Pomni drink bubble tea. <laughs> it looks like she really wants to drink it. Oh no, it's bubble tea again with cockroaches and poop floating in it. I still don't understand who in their right mind would drink a drink that contains such animals. It looks like she has no other choice because right now she is in the desert and that is why she will have to drink this drink because it is the only liquid she has. But I'm very glad that we were able to help her. And now we need to help Keekin Chicken. It looks like he smells really bad. Wait, why is there, instead of a Keekin Chicken, some strange yellow cat that is doused with a trunk? It is very strange. Anyway, we were able to clean this cat up and now he looks extremely clean. Wait, what? Is it me again? Lord, it seems to me that I will soon start suing the developers of this game because they are presenting me like this. Yes, this is really starting to piss us off a little because it looks extremely stupid. But this time, this level ended well and you look extremely happy here. Now we need to help Jax make some noodles. Noodles? God, I hate noodles. It seems to me that the developers of this game should consult with us and find out a little more about us. Because it seems to me that the developers of this game do not even realize that Gangle is actually a girl. I'll tell you a secret, but in fact, most of our viewers have no idea that I'm actually a girl. Perhaps this is because in two episodes my character was very poorly developed in our cartoon. By the way, we were just able to help give this guy an injection. I really hope it helps him become healthier. There are some really weird things happening in this game. By the way, now we need to help Bobby with his cough. Looks like it's caused by tonsillitis stuck in his throat. Oh my god, when will these nasty levels in this game end? It seems to me that I will really soon be sick of what I see here. But now we need to go through a pretty nice level. We need to make sure that they... Oh god, why are they kissing so disgustingly? We had to hide it again. It seems to me that the developers of this game really go a little overboard with what they do in this game because sometimes some things look not just disgusting but even immoral. For example, the levels in which we need to help deliver births of various animals. I've been trying to tell you about this for several episodes in a row. We actually go through this game and every time the most obscene things happen here, now we've helped tear the scorpion off Catnap's butt. Looks like this level is going to be pretty sweet. Here, Pomni and Regatta are just playing patsies with each other. Or, it looks like they again made some kind of obscene figure out of their hands. 
This game seems truly incorrigible to me. There are always some nasty things happening here. Oh no! It looks like the catnap received a bullet wound. It's good that experienced surgeons like us were next to him, and we were able to help him. Oh no! Someone took away Bubbles' pacifier. The developers offer us to give him a bottle for advertising, but I think that Bubble will be happy even if he sucks the most ordinary pacifier. But unfortunately, for some reason, it gets stuck in his head. Maybe you should just be a little careful. Okay, looks like I'll have to suck this pacifier through my chin. But I'm very glad that we were able to help Piggy. And now... Oh God, what's going on here? Wait, are these real breasts? We should close the most obscene place here. Okay, it's good that we passed this level very quickly. In fact, he looked as strange as possible. And now we need to help Catnap dodge bullets. It's very strange that he's crying like a baby here. Wait, what? Where is the catnap and where are the bullets? I didn't understand at all what was happening here. For some reason, we suck out the snot of a baby and the viruses that were in his nose get stuck on his lips. This is weird. It seems to me that you and I are now in a hopeless situation and we may have to restart this level in order to pass it because these viruses are stuck and don't want to go beyond this green line. Wait, Kane, do not rush. I will still try to pass this level and make every effort to do it on the first try. This is my main goal. I really hope that I can do this. At least I will try to do my best for this. It's very strange that you are ready to enjoy this disgusting spectacle for a very long time instead of just restarting this level and passing it quickly. Well, okay, let's see how some strange mouth sucks the snot out of a baby. Stop disturbing him. He really almost succeeded. It only takes a little effort to push these viruses beyond the green line. Great, finally we did it but I still don't understand what does catnap have to do with it. Am I having any problems in this game again? God, this game is starting to really piss me off. Why are the developers of this game making me look like such a fool here? In fact, I envy you very much because you get a lot of attention. For example, me and the candy princess in this game. Unfortunately not. But I really wanted to participate in at least one level of this game. I hope that in the next part, the developers will definitely add me. I think that all you can do is hope, because such stupid and mediocre secondary characters are usually not added to games. By the way, we just helped make some kind of thing and now we need to help the Kikin Chikin drink water. For this, we need to place the stones in this container. Your words towards him were studied very rudely. I think you should apologize, but I won't insist on it now so that we don't ruin this video. Let's just focus on beating this game. By the way, have you noticed that the stones here are also starting to get stuck in the walls of this flask? It seems to me that the developers should work more on optimizing this game. Don't worry, I can still do it. Look, the water finally poured out of this flask and we could finally give Chicken Chicken a drink. It's great. And in this level, we need to help the mermaid regatta cover her chest. Wait, seriously, me again? And you want to say that besides the fact that I need to cover my chest here, I will kill the poor clam for this? Lord, the developer of this game is a really sick bastard. Be careful with your words, Regatta. You haven't forgotten that in our digital circus you can't be bad, have you? In words, by the way, now we need to very quickly help Kickin' Chicken call for emergency help. Great! Now he will feel alive and healthy. And now we need to help Piggy brew some kind of potion. To do this, we need to take this green apple and stir it in the cauldron. Great! Now he will feel alive and healthy. And now we need to help Piggy brew some kind of potion. <laughs> to do this, we need to take this green apple and stir it in the cauldron. Looks like Pomni slipped here and dropped her phone in the toilet. Now we need to get this phone out of the toilet without getting our hands dirty. Great! I hope that everything is fine with the phone and we move on. Oh no! I choked! I urgently need help! Wait, seriously? I choked on regular hair? It's impossible for them to choke. Well, okay, the main thing is that we were able to help me. It looks like there is a leak in this pipe and we urgently need to fix it. Let's do it. Now we need to pull out this damaged pipe and install a new one. Cool, we were able to fix the pipe. This level was pretty easy. What awaits us in the next level? Let's see it. Oh, looks like Jax played guitar and his guitar broke. Let's put those strings back in place so this guitar can be used again. This task looks pretty easy. I think we can complete it very quickly. Looks like we messed up those strings a little, but Jax is happy with the guitar he got. 
I actually don't know how to play the guitar, but it looks like this game opens up new opportunities for me. And now we need to help this strange character who got electrocuted. To do this, we need to remove the plug from the socket. Great, now he's saved. It looks like he had a blast. Well, now he will know that water should be kept away from outlets. And now we need to wash the catnap. It looks like it fell somewhere and got very dirty. Let's soap him up to make him clean. I think we've lathered him up enough. Now we need to wash off all this foam from him so that this dirt can be washed off him along with this foam. Finally, it will be clean and look like always. Great, now it's clean and attractive. Well, this level is behind us too. And now, oh God, is it me again? When will they stop using my face here? It seems that here you really wanted to meet the prince, but you went a little overboard with your efforts and tried to eat a frog. And now we need to help Crafty Corn clean all the maggots from his teeth. I think what you just described and the words cool and interesting don't quite go together, at least because we really have to get maggots out of our teeth. This is really a very disgusting spectacle, but what our viewers like is what we like too. We finally cleaned all his teeth and now we need to help Regatta. She has some very strange problems. Why are you always screaming? Okay, I don't want to know the answer to this question because if you scream that too, my head will explode. Now we need to help Cat Nap clean his paws. Maggots again? God, can we play something less disgusting than this game? I myself would like to play something less vile, but today we have gathered here to play this game after all. We were able to clean his paws. Now let's move on to the next level. Here looks like Jax's armpits smell bad. Looks like we'll have to make them clean. Ooh, Jax! It's time for you to take a little care of your armpits, especially that long hair. Have you ever shaved them in your life? Bro, are you so stupid that you don't understand that I have fur on my armpits and not hair? I'm a hare, and my whole body is covered with fur. Okay, let's not quarrel and continue playing this game. Looks like there's something wrong with his legs. We need to get the maggots out of his leg because it is very swollen because of this. It seems to me that today we come across too many levels with maggots, don't we? It's just that sometimes I feel like I'm really gonna vomit. I hope we don't see them again. Now let's move on. Wait, what? No, I didn't mean to do this. Although, no, no, I didn't mean to. Don't worry, Gangle. Even if you were going to, I still wouldn't agree in real life. Wow, I think it sounded too offensive and rude. I think I would never want to hear anything like that in real life. Let's just forget about what we heard. And now we need to help Kaufmo warm up. It seems to me that he is very cold. He is lucky that he has matches, thanks to which we can light a fire. Wait, seriously? Are we going to make a fire with two matches? It seems to me that this is impossible to warm any part of your body. And now we need to help Jax. Looks like he has some stomach problems. But there are two characters here, and unfortunately we need to watch advertisements in order to help Regatta. That's why we chose Jax. Wait, seriously? Worms? Lord Jax, what do you eat so much that worms take up residence inside your intestines? This looks as disgusting as possible. It seems to me that you're really forgetting the fact that this is just a game and it has nothing to do with real life. In general, we are artificial intelligence, damn it. Where can we get worms and worms and maggots under the skin? By the way, yes, I'm really starting to forget at the moment that these are just ideas of sick authors. Well, we helped Kofmo straighten his spine, and now we need to help Pomni cook noodles. It seems to me that if noodles really appeared in front of me now, I would jump on it with the same face because I'm already very tired of digital food. No offense to you, Bubble. Don't worry, Pomni. I take no offense. Just next time when everyone is eating digital lasagna, you will be eating digital maggots. By the way, I really like this dish too. Maybe I should cook it too? What's the point if it still has no taste? Okay, we've completed this level. Now we need to help Catnap. He has some problems with his car. It's very strange that the developers of this game constantly schematically describe this breakdown exactly like that, as if some wiring had simply broken out of its connector. But thanks to this, we can easily pass this level. And here, we need to help Keek and Chicken rob this safe and decorate everything from it. I think it's very bad to help thieves, but on the other hand, we cannot pass this level if we don't help. So let's just do it right now. 
It seems to me that he will get very rich after this robbery, because these bundles of money are very large. And in addition to this, there is also gold jewelry with diamonds that looks very expensive. But robbing is very bad, and it's always better to just develop yourself. And thanks to this, you become rich instead of stealing someone else's things and getting other people's items illegally. While we were talking about all sorts of moral things, Regatta craps herself in space, and the gangle is very upset. But it seems to me that this happened after she refused his marriage proposal. Can you guys try using slightly different names or something? Because for me, it is very offensive to hear this. This is quite difficult to do because it is really you who is depicted here. By the way, we passed this level by planting a flag with a cheerful smiling face on it. Well, now let's move on to the next level. Looks like this level is really less disgusting. We need to make a salad. Now we need to wash this leaf so that it can be used in the salad. Looks like we washed all the worms off this leaf with a jet of water, but it's still dirty. We need to wash it. Great, now it is completely clean. You can use it in salad. By the way, this salad looks pretty tasty. Wait, what? Mayonnaise? No, this salad will be too high in calories. It would be better to season it with olive oil. Guys, I think we should stop her from talking in long lines because her British accent hurts my ears so much that I can't calmly continue playing. Wow, I really didn't expect to hear this from you, but I finally agree with you. By the way, in this level, we need to help Keekin Chicken lay eggs. This is quite strange because he is not a chicken, but a rooster. Roosters don't usually lay eggs. I think it's very stupid to look for logic in this game in which we take maggots out from under the skin and help people poop. By the way, for some reason, this egg stuck to his cloaca. It seems to me that we should try to get the second egg and push this egg with it. Wow, is this thing really called a cloaca? I think this is the most disgusting name you could come up with for chicken intestines. Well, I think it's really worth trying to use the first egg to push out the second one. Let's finally do it. Great. We passed this level. Now, let's move on to the next one. If I wanted to play something that I can't do in real life, I would play GTA Thieve. But I definitely wouldn't give birth to a cat. GTA 5? This is also quite cruel. But based on your character, this is not surprising. In any case, it is better to play GTA 5 than to play this very strange and incomprehensible game. Stop judging her for choosing her favorite game. At least many of our viewers like it. You never know if some of our viewers decide to become a doctor, and it will be useful for him to see this in order to know how to give injections. But in general, the game is really very cool. For example, in this level, we don't need to do anything nasty. We just have to make some ramen for Gangle. This is a very kind and useful level for those who don't know how to do it. This stupid teapot is so hard to grab. It constantly continues to spin in space. It needs to be fixed in one position. Great, we managed to do it. Okay, I admit it. This game actually has some pretty interesting levels sometimes, but this level seems to be the most idiotic. Poop and bubble tea? It seems to me that you definitely can't drink bubble tea like this anymore. Its color looks extremely unreliable. Looks like Jax is so thirsty here that he has no choice but to drink this drink. If in real life I was offered the opportunity to drink such a drink or continue to suffer from thirst, I would obviously choose to die in the desert. It's good that you haven't been in such a situation, and most likely you won't find yourself. Oh my god! Now we need to get tonsillitis from Hoppy Hopscoke. First of all, you said his name wrong again. And secondly, what is tonsillitis and why is it in the mouth? I think it's better for you not to know. At least you'll know it when you're a little older. And now we need to help this sweet couple fall in love. We need to hit the heart with this very flexible arrow. It seems to me that it is impossible to- Oh my god! God! I need to cover this with my face so that we don't get banned! Did any of you say that this game has adequate levels? Well, they haven't been observed yet. At least now we had to stick some bird's head up this guy's ass. This game really continues to surprise me, but not in a good way. Well, I hope there will be more adequate levels ahead. All we can do is hope. Oh my god, why do my feet stink so much in this level? It seems to me that Kaufmo is as unpleasant as possible standing next to me. I think in real life, this is the least that can bother him now. Now let's wash our feet so they stop stinking. It seems to me that such a process is too much water. It would have been enough to make do with less. And now we need to put the shoe on my foot. Great. We got it done. Firstly, everyone is already tired of you with your crazy savings. And secondly, where did you get the idea that this is your leg? 
because at the very beginning of this game, we understood that this was Ragada's leg. Okay, let's stop focusing so much attention on this. Now we had to get Scorpio and put him in this bucket. Great! Pomni became a Giga Chad after that. Now let's help the bubble. Seriously? Nipple? But I haven't used this thing for a very long time. I don't understand why I need it. Okay, let's try to help me. Whoa, wait! It seems to me that no liquid should come out of this thing. There is too much of it here, and it seems to me that this definitely should not have happened in this game. I think we should stop being surprised by the things that happen in this game. Oh no, it seems that the boundaries of adequacy are expanding more and more with each level. Did we really just perform breast augmentation surgery on me? Do you still want to stop being surprised by what's happening in this game? I think that everything that happens here is beyond absurdity. One way or another, we need to keep going through the levels. Oh look, looks like it's Jax's birthday and we need to light the candles on his birthday cake. Well, I'll be very happy to help him with that. In fact, my birthday is not very soon, but I will pretend as if I am very happy about this strange congratulation. But in reality, I wouldn't want anything to do with this game. And now we need to help the Gangle harvest carrots. This level seems pretty adequate. All we need to do is just pour water on the carrots to make them bigger and then harvest. There's nothing nasty about that, is there? You are right, but such levels are extremely rare. I actually really like looking at these cute and smiling carrots. And now we move on to the next level, where we need to make coffee for Kaufmo. It's good that this time the coffee is not the same as the last time where we had to get this coffee from the intestines of some animal. And by the way, they wrote to us in the comments that coffee really exists and it even sounds disgusting. I really hope I don't have to drink coffee like this ever in my life. It seems to me that this coffee is too expensive, so you won't be able to try it even if you have the desire. By the way, we just made coffee for Kaufmo. And now we need to help Hoppy Hopscotch, who is sitting in the pool and planning something. Oh no, looks like he's going to shit himself in the pool. Well, it's a pity that we have to help him with this. Unfortunately, we have no other choice. Well, we helped him. And now we need to help Catnap. It looks like he has Lego pieces stuck in his leg and his leg hurts really bad. Well, now that we helped him, he will have to walk with a bandaged leg for some time. Oh my god, not this. This is the level where you need to tear off a hangnail. It looks as painful as possible. I would like to turn away from the screen at this moment. The funny thing is that you didn't even notice that it was you who participated in this level. And now we need to help push this hot pepper down the intestines. It seems to me that this is as painful as possible. After all, I really don't like spicy food. It seems to me that this food was too spicy even for his intestines. Now we need to help the bees stop the thief of their hive. It's very strange that Dog Day decided to steal their hive because he's a very kind guy. I really don't want to help the bees because the dog is our friend. And now, let's help remember. She has problems with her teeth. We need to replace one bad tooth with a good one. This tooth looks extremely painful. It's good that it comes without any additional tools because it would be very painful for me to see how we pull out a tooth because I'm too sensitive. Hello, Hello everyone, friends. I think that our game today needs no introduction. Yes, yes. This is your favorite game in the world again. By the way, we now saved Crafty Corn from a robber. They escaped from here on horseback with Dog Day. This is very nice. And here the Gangle decided to jump out with a parachute. Well, let's help him open it. I think that I can cope quite well without your help. But I don't know what height is safe for me. Therefore, it is better that you do it. Excellent. I'm flying down. Looks like some girl broke Jax's heart here. Well, let's help him get rid of all the memories of her. I need to throw away all her photos. I'm really, really interested to know who it was. I think it's better for you not to know. We did a great job with this task, and let's just forget it and move on to the next one. It looks like Bubba Bubba Fant fell for this childish trick and decided to lick the frozen metal pole. Well, let's pour boiling water on his tongue so that his tongue will thaw and he can use it again as before. As a child? I also fell for a similar trick and had to stand near a frozen pole with my tongue stuck to it for about two hours. It's good that I found someone who could help me. Well, we completed this task. Now let's help Bobby Bear Hug get honey from this hive. Jax, it seems to me that what you are doing is slightly wrong. In my opinion, honey should flow into this pot, but not bees. Otherwise, it will be impossible to eat this honey from there. Now Bobby can finally eat honey. Great. I'm very glad we were able to help him. Looks like Jax found a dinosaur skull. 
Let's help him recreate it. Recreate a dinosaur? Sounds like an extremely idiotic idea, but the game requires this from us, so let's still help and do it. Great! We've got a giant dinosaur and it looks like Jax is going to ride it. Well, I hope he doesn't do bad things after this. And now we need to help Regatta restore the picture. It's very strange that we decided to do this without the help of glue and we just assemble the picture into one frame. I hope this will really help us restore this picture and Regatta will be pleased. Last piece left. Great. We were finally able to put this picture together. It turns out that this is the Mona Lisa Regatta. Cool. This picture really looks very cool. Now let's go straight to the next level. Oh no! Looks like my favorite wall clock is broken. We need to fix them. They should show 12 o'clock. Let's move all the hands to 12 though, so that they show the correct time. Great. We were able to fix the clock and now Kane is happy. But it looks like he was slightly hit on the head. Oh my god, what's going on here with Kofmo? Why is he crying? Wait, we really need to kill him here. I don't really want to do this, but it looks like we have no other choice. Well, I hope we don't hurt him. I don't know how this can be done without hurting him, but it seems to me that he is actually deceiving us, and he has some kind of insidious plan, thanks to which he will get out of this thing and remain safe and sound. Last sword left. We need to stick it in. Now we will find out what really happened to him. It turns out that he is safe and sound. He's been trolling us this whole time. Okay. Now we need to help make a sculpture. I wonder what kind of sculpture he is going to make from this huge stone. Let's take a look already. It seems that he loves himself so much that he decided to make a sculpture of himself. By the way, this sculpture turned out quite beautiful and I really like it. Now let's help Bubby Bubba Fant get the peas out of the pod. But in fact, I don't know if he will get enough of one pod. Maybe he's not going to eat those peas. Maybe he needs it for something else. Let's get all the peas and find out. Oh, I think he just decided to have fun and shoot these peas. I think this is pretty fun. At least I would like to do something like that too. Now we need to help Catnap get the fish. I hope he's not going to eat her. It seems to me that he takes her out just for this. After all, cats really love to eat fish. Oh, it turns out no. He just fell in love with her very much and wanted to kiss her. Well, this is very cute. Now we need to help Pomni throw the ball into the basket. And now there will be a slam dunk. Wow, it was a three-point shot. Pomni, do you happen to have any famous basketball players in your family like LeBron James? It looks like the catnap has something wrong with its paw. Oh no, it seems to me that he hasn't looked after her for so long that his claws have begun to rot and there are a lot of maggots in his paws. This looks extremely disgusting. I hope he can keep that paw healthy after we get everything out of it. Let's finally get these maggots out of his paw so that they don't leave larvae there and continue their life activities. Great! It seems to me that he is very pleased. And now we need to fix the Jack's cake. I wonder what could be wrong with him. Oh my god! Worms have attacked this cake and want to eat it! In any case, it seems to me that you can't eat a cake after so many worms have sat on it because this can lead to some kind of infection. It looks like Jax is not bothered by all this at all, and he eats this cake with great pleasure. Well, let's leave him alone with this cake, and now we need to help Pomni. Oh, looks like we're going to shave her head. What? No! Lord, don't tell me that you're planning to shave my head. Oh my god, am I going to wake up bald? This is the most terrible thing. They already took everything from me, and now they've also taken my hair. Lord, how long can this go on? Don't worry, Pomni. This is just a game. Your hair will actually stay in place. By the way, we just helped a crocodile eat a catnap. But it looks like catnap isn't digested very well in this crocodile's stomach. It looks like Hoppy Hopscotch decided to prank his friend and add Mentis to his cola. It seems to me that now we will make a very funny fountain. So it begins. Wow, just look at this pressure. It seems to me that everyone around will be covered in Coca-Cola, but it seems that only Hoppy himself suffered from this. Well now, let's help Catnap. He dreams of a fish. Is he really unable to swallow this fish himself? Okay, let's help him. It seems to me that he is not particularly pleased when this fish is stuffed into his mouth like that, but that's what he wanted. So let's keep doing it. Finally, this fish is in place and we have passed this level. It was pretty easy. Now let's help Jax pick his ears. It seems to me that it is very dirty there. That's where the green gas comes from. It looks like things are really very bad there. Oh my God, buddy. There are bugs in your ear. Let's get them out as soon as possible. Great. Finally, his ears are clean. It looks like Jax is very happy with this. 
And here, for example, I need to get a sword out of a stone to defeat a dragon. You yourself understand perfectly well that such levels in this game are very rare. But you defeated the dragon. This is very cool. And in this level, you need to help Hoppy Hopscotch chop the log. Well, this is a pretty easy task. Great, we dealt with it. Look what a house he built for himself. Was he really able to build all this on his own? Okay, he's not as stupid as I thought. And now we need to help Crafty Corn escape from the wolf. And for this, we need to peel the sausage. And I always thought that in order to escape from a wolf, you need to move your legs very quickly. Well, okay, the main thing is that we were able to help him. And now we need to help Catnap escape from the zombies. He cured him, and now Hoppy Hopscotch is not a zombie. This is very cool. And now we need to help Pomni get to the treasures. And to do this, we need to cut down the lock with an axe. Looks like this isn't quite what she expected. Okay, let's move on to the next level, and here we need to rescue Kofmo from the web. How did he even manage to get there? Although I don't think it matters. Okay. Now we need to remove all these little spiders from the web so that he feels safe. Why is he afraid of these little spiders? They look extremely cute and safe. Oh, looks like a big spider is about to attack him. And now we need to help Jax the vampire. Um, wait, do we really need to fill his heart with blood from this jug now? Seriously? Okay, because of the rather strange physics in this game, this is quite difficult to do, but I think that we will try to carefully bring this jug to this heart so that the stream gets where it is needed. This jug is acting pretty weird. It is very difficult to grab it so that it starts to turn over chaotically. But in this strange way, we will now try to fill it to the end. This is really one of the most difficult tasks in this game. Great! The stream gets where it needs to go. We finally managed to fix this jug and we finally completed this task. Now let's help Regatta escape from the wolf. What are these pies? Wait, seriously? Are we going to feed the wolf pies so that he doesn't eat the regatta? Okay, that sounds pretty logical, and I hope it can really help her. But unfortunately, due to the physics in this game, it is quite difficult to do this. Cool! The pies have finally reached his stomach and it looks like he is finally full. Cool! Thanks to this, the regatta will remain intact. Now we need to help the catnap catch this fish using a fishing rod from the pond. This task is really quite simple because here we didn't even need to use bait. Cool, we were able to pass it. And now we need to help Keekin Chicken get the apples. Do chickens eat apples? Okay, I shouldn't think about that. The strangest thing is that he was depicted there with a broken arm. Perhaps something happened to him and because of this, he is not able to get the apples of the tree on his own. Now he's full of these apples! Wait, seriously! Now we need to help Jax do the same. Okay, it's really a little weird that Jax has a human face. Although in principle, the fact that he talks is also quite strange. Well, now let's help get this acorn out of the ice. To do this, we first need to remove the cloud so that the ice around the acorn begins to melt and we can safely get it. Great! It wasn't as difficult as I thought. And now it's the squirrel who stole the acorn and ran away. And now we need to help you eat watermelon. Okay, let's do this. Looks like to do this, we need to cut it first. Great, we have three perfectly even parts. Now let's put them in his mouth so that he can eat the watermelon. Last piece left. Let's complete this task as quickly as possible. Great, we were able to do it. Well, now you need to roll this billiard ball into his mouth. This is some pretty weird prank. But I think he's pretty funny. I would love to make a joke like that to some friend of mine. Great. We did it, and it looks like more than one billiard ball rolled into his mouth during this time. Oh my god! His mouth looks like he's never cleaned it in his life. Well, great. We were able to help him with this. And now, we need to go through the next level. And it looks like Hoppy Hopscotch choked on his carrot a little. Now we need to help him swallow this carrot so that he doesn't choke. This is also quite difficult to do because sometimes, for some reason, this carrot sticks and does not want to move on. But we managed to do it. And now Hoppy Hopscotch is finally saved. Well, now let's move on to the next level. And here we need to help fix the brains. Did he really have turd instead of brains all this time? Well, it seems to me that many people lack such an operation in which they can replace the contents of their skull with an adequate brain. His head closes as if it were a car door. This looks extremely strange, but it seems that now he is a brilliant scientist. And now we need to help Catnap get rid of the robber. We got Ginger out of the ground and now Catnap is saved? Um, okay, it was quite strange. Oh, 
Are these worms, Jax? I didn't know you had worms. There is nothing shameful about this. It happens to any animal. And as we know, Jax is a hare. It looks like we managed to free him from these worms in his butt. And now he is very happy. And now we need to help Kafmo. Looks like he's a little cold. We need to help him light a fire with matches. I wonder where he was that he had to make a fire. It looks like he got a little lost in some forest. Great. We were able to light a fire for him, and now we need to help Crafty Corn and Bobby Bearhag. What is this strange, incomprehensible labyrinth? We need to help some strange weirdo get to the center of this maze. But I don't understand anything. What does Bobby and Crafty have to do with it? What's going on here? Why did Crafty become pregnant and Bobby fell asleep and for some reason Crafty was angry with him? I do not understand anything. Oh well, now we need to help the hobbies Hopscotch and Picky Piggy. We need to connect an IV to save the piggy. Okay, let's do this. Okay, we connected the IV and now we need to insert it into him. It looks as creepy as possible, but I really hope that this will help him and he will start to feel better. 